episode in my Starbucks refresher series where I'm making my way through all of the Starbucks refreshers so you can make them at home and save yourself some money. Today, I am making the Berry Berry Hibiscus refresher, which is actually discontinued at Starbucks. Not sure why, because it is delicious. So not only are you gonna save some money, but you'll actually be able to have this drink drink again. You don't need all of these ingredients, but I do want to show you that you can make this multiple ways. The first way is with tea bags. So you can do green tea as well as hibiscus tea bag. If you go this route, I have found that the hibiscus flavor is not very strong. It tastes more like the blackberries and more like green tea than it does hibiscus. So I'm going to actually use these hibiscus leaves that I just steeped in water and let them cool to room temperature, which is what I have here. And then you can pour that into your shaker bottle. So let's get started. This is my hibiscus tea that I want to strain the leaves out. Nice cat. All right, so I have the hibiscus tea in here. And then what I'm gonna do is add this green coffee bean powder. You won't need this if you're using the green tea bag, but to give it that little extra caffeine kick that you get in the Starbucks refreshers, you will need to add this powder. I got it from Amazon. And I'm gonna go in with this Tarani cane sugar sweetener. It's really just sugar and water. You can make this yourself, add sugar and water to a pot, bring it to a boil, and then let it cool to room temperature and you'll have just a simple syrup. There's no flavoring in it, it's literally just a sweetener. You can also use stevia if you like. And then I'm also gonna add white grape juice, about four to six-ish ounces. And lastly, just some frozen blackberries. This is gonna give it that very berry flavor. All right, and then put your shaker bottle top on. You really want to shake it well to get that coffee bean extract mixed in. You don't want to suck up a clump <laughs> of the powder. Shake your food. All right. Look how gorgeous this color is. Then I have my Starbucks cup. I just wash and reuse these after I go to Starbucks so that I can feel like I'm drinking Starbucks every day of the week. All right. So to the cup, I'm adding ice. I'm adding ice. Pull it up. Then carefully add the hibiscus mixture. Carefully, cat. Let's give it a taste. Oh my gosh, but it's so good. Oh, my Atlanta. Very, very good. I will link all of the products in the description. If you try this recipe, comment down below or tag me on Instagram at Katarina Faith. I would love to see your very, very hibiscus refresher recreation. Why am I talking like this? <laughs> but there you go. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy this very, very hibiscus refresher creation. It is very good. And now that Starbucks doesn't sell them, you can make your own at home. And I will see you in the next video.